guys! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm so pleased you joined us. I'm Jojo and this is Baxter. Today we've got the haul from the, the last video that I did. So I went into TK Maxx and my goodness, I was so pleasantly surprised with how much extra they had for um, autumn. I mean, they had mugs, they had more pumpkins, they had seasonal decor that they didn't have when I did my video before that. So I was so, so pleased because I really wanted a mug. I really wanted a mug. <laughs> so I wanted a mug that was shaped like a pumpkin. Because I've seen people on YouTube in England and America, places like that, who managed to find mugs shaped like pumpkins. Just like really um, kind of aesthetic without like the colour and things like that. But I obviously couldn't get anything like that. But then I saw this. This stood out to me as something that I would very much like and it's not it's not a scary Halloween mug it's more of a whimsical pumpkin mug and I love the detail of it I love the gradient it's got like black here and then it's got a gradient going through to orange I love the feel of it as well it's really it's not um oh how would I explain it it's not like the feeling of the inside. It's got like a, not furry texture, but do you know what I mean? It's got like this lovely, lovely feel to it. Whoa, my ring light's going nuts. I hope the bulb's not going, uh oh. <laughs> Sorry if you can see little kind of flashing. I think the bulb's on its way out. Oh dear. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I've got to finish this video before the bulb goes. Oh no. But I'll show you this up close. It's just so cute. I love it. I know that you were having trouble. So I just absolutely love that. So that's six, that was $6.99 and it's by a company called Cobwebs and Cauldrons, designed in the new in the USA. So you can just tell that the TK Maxx stuff is American, isn't it? Just gorgeous. I love it. That's gonna go in my intros. So excited. <laughs> and then in choice discount store. So I'm thinking of dressing as Harley Quinn for my son and I's kind of part carving pumpkin. Carbon pumpkin? Carbon <laughs> pumpkin. Pumpkin carving night. <laughs> wow. So we don't really um we don't really necessarily celebrate Halloween, but we do a pumpkin carving and snacks and like Beetlejuice movie um sort of night. So we're really looking forward to that. And I was thinking of because we always film it as well. For my channel so I was thinking of dressing like Harley Quinn and I saw this in choice discount I mean what the actual eh <laughs> isn't that amazing so it's obviously to rep it's like a replica of the baseball bat that Harley Quinn has in the movies and it's got all the the writing on it and everything it's plastic obviously but it was like six dollars it was six dollars I just think it's amazing so that's gonna go really really well with my outfit which brings me to this so I picked up the gloves the Harley Quinn gloves I think these were three dollars I should have got a receipt. She asked me if I wanted a receipt and I said no. Forgetting I was doing a channel and needed to know how much things were. 
but yes I picked up the Harley Quinn gloves so I'm thinking of just having the gloves on having this painting my face and looking a bit Harley Quinn-esque just to I don't know just to theme the night <laughs> So I thought that was a real bargain, absolutely brilliant. Then I also picked up some little spiders. I wanted to dot them around for the pumpkin carving and snacks. I'll just put them in between the snacks and things. And I might also put a few little spiders in with the wrapped sweets that I put out for the kids so they can have a spider to take home with them. And that was, two dollars then I got some sorry I got some sweets if you can hear Elliot in the background he's playing on his computer and it's like right next door so I do apologize if you can hear that and it's like annoying you sorry <laughs> but I bought him some um, party favorite sweets because he's doing a thing at school called young entrepreneurs and they're taking things in to sell so he's taking lollies as you would as a kid <laughs> he's taking what you call lollies uh called sweets but um yeah he's taking lollies in with him um to sell so i got him a big bag and i think that was 3.99 which i thought was really good for that size of a bag so i'm going to give them to him then i picked up i wanted a blanket this morning right Stephen got up in the middle of the night because he had a pain in his leg and he wanted to take some ibuprofen so he got up in the middle of the night and he was in the kitchen for ages i was in a deep sleep but then i kind of stirred and heard him and you know when you kind of think what's up because he was there for ages and you kind of think why is he in there but you're like half asleep and then I kind of woke it woke me up and then he came back to bed and went to sleep and started snoring and then I couldn't get back to sleep so I went into the kitchen and it was like dark like this and it was freezing I was so cold and all I wanted was a blanket and we don't have any kind of fleecy blankets the dog's stolen any blankets that we've got he's like got them on his bed so I really wanted a blanket this was ten dollars so they had loads of patterns loads of designs and um, this one stood out to me as being the nicest it's let's have a look let's get it out it's got like flowers all over it I just thought that was really really nice for ten dollars and it's quite big as well big fluffy blanket I bet the dog tries to claim it he's sitting there being a good lad I told him not to jump up at me, so he's not. Isn't he a good boy? You're doing as you're told. Oh, such a good lad. You can steal it if you want. Gorgeous boy. <laughs> but anyway, it's so soft. All their blankets are so soft. It's the same material as the pyjama bottoms that I bought from there that time. Not so long ago, a couple of videos ago. And they're so warm really lovely jammers I love them just jammer bottoms I didn't buy the top I don't think they had the top actually but yeah that is so soft <gasps> I began to get myself together again you are back once more like everything's the same oh he's being such a good boy he hasn't even stolen it oh. Okay, what else did I get? So I got some creepy creatures, <laughs> creepy crawlers. So it's just a bag of basic, like, let's get them out. <laughs> creepy crawlies. I thought maybe I would put a couple of these in between the sweets for the kids. Gonna see. There you go, darling. You have a look at that. It's not to eat. You can't eat it. And I would put that in between like the snacks that we have. Reminds me of Beetlejuice. We got all the little creepy crawlers. So what else have we got? We've got a scorpion. I couldn't think of the word there. A little scorpion. And what else? Ugh. Spider. Oh, that actually made my hair stand up on my arms. 
don't like spiders at all. I mean, I know it's a toy, so. <laughs> What's that? And then it's also got little rats in it as well. So I thought I would just dot them around at Halloween time. And they were, I think they were $2 as well for the bag, which is such a bargain. Honestly, such a bargain. Sorry, my hair's like driving me insane. There we go. Okay. And then I got these earrings because I thought they were really nice. $2.50 I think they were. And they're just buttons. But I actually like them, like like them like them <laughs> for earrings, just to wear in general. I don't know if you can see them, I'll do them up close so that you can see them. When I begin to get myself together again, you are Oh they're lovely. I really like them. Just want to wear them in general. <laughs> okay, what else did I get? Pop tarts. I always pick up a pop a pack a pop a pop a a pop a pop a I always pick up a pack of pop tarts. Try saying that when you're drunk. Uh, these are the cookies and cream pop tarts because my husband and son really like pop tarts. So I thought I would pick some of them up for them. I think they were two fifty. Don't quote me on that. And then I picked up some finish dishwasher tablets the one with the ball inside and these are actually the squishy ones because we've been using the ones with the ball inside the uh, quantum titanium or something I don't know and a couple of well about five I don't know it's happened about five times where the tablet hasn't dissolved so I'm thinking of trying these ones I did try the yellow ones not so long ago before the other pack that we bought ran out before the pack we bought before this ran out my god <laughs> it's been a long day <laughs> anyway want to try these ones tried the yellow ones they were a bit fragrant which made all the dishes kind of fragrant and made the fuel food smell and taste like the dishwasher tablet so i got the blue ones instead that was a really long way of telling you I got blue finished dishwasher tablet. Anyway, I'm gonna try them, see what they're like. What? Sorry about that. He's playing a shooting game and when he loses, he gets annoyed and stuff. Anyway. <laughs> Picked up two of these for me and Elliot. I don't like skulls, but they were the only um, plastic drinking containers that they had. They were two dollars each I think um, and this is just for when we do the pumpkin carving and snacks night just so we can have some drinks in them. And then what else did I get? I picked up two of these chicken tonight things 50 cents each and one of them is smoked Texan chicken drumsticks. Now we used this yesterday in a fajita um, meal that we did. Well, Stephen did. Stephen cooked it. He cooked himself a chicken. Oh, man. He likes it. It's not for him, but he will play in it. I play in it. Sit in it. <laughs> I think I need a glass of wine. <laughs> this was beautiful. It's the smoked Texan chicken drumsticks and he used it for a fajita mix and it was just divine. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. Highly recommend. So I also picked up a Louisiana style barbecue chicken skewers um, sauce as well just to try it for 50 cents each. I mean, you can't be robbed. I know why they're only 50 cents each. They run out on the 1st of September. That's why. But the thing is, we'll eat them before then anyway. So it's all good. Whatever. <laughs> okay, and last but not least. Sorry for the rattling. Last but not least, I picked up two packets of sweets. I know it's really early for Halloween, but I like to get stocked up um, just in case I forget. Or whatever. I wouldn't forget, but you know, just to have them in so that we've got them in. We got, I got some Monster Drops little packets. I like the wrapped, like I said in the last video, I like the wrapped sweets because it's 
hygienic, isn't it? When the kids have got their hands in the bowl, you don't want to have sweets that aren't wrapped. So yeah, I've got these little monster drop wrapped sweets and some candy pops, which are just lollipops really, just to chuck in the, the bowl for them. So that's my, um, my quick haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Do you like my mug? Tell me down below if you like my mug. So excited, honestly. Well, you know, you know, you know me. If you've been following me for a while, you know how excited I get about little things in life. And there's nothing wrong with that, is there? <laughs> Gotta be happy. Gotta be happy. Stuff like this just makes me happy. So, okay, I am going to finish the night up. I had lunch beef. Lunch? Oh my God. I need to just... I need to go and settle down and have a glass of wine because I can't speak. I had my dinner before I sat down to do this video and now I'm going to go in, eat chocolate and drink wine and watch something on TV. I might watch The Devil Wears Prada or something. I love that movie. My favourite movie. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video guys. Thanks for tuning in. I'd love to see you in my next video. Bye! Mwah. Ooh, without you by my side